What is up YouTube? Another sneaker unboxing that I am super excited about today. So if you haven't seen my previous video, I talked about how much I love this shoe right here, the New Balance Fresh Foam District Vision collab. I grabbed this probably a month ago and have been wearing them just nonstop. The shoe is so comfortable. It looks so good with so many outfits and I just absolutely love it. This is probably my favorite shoe right now in my collection, which is crazy because I have SBs, New Balances, Asics, um, XT6s. So the fact that this is my favorite speaks volumes. So uh, the story goes, New Balance released these after District Vision's uh, website release. I decided to go with New Balance on their site just because I think it was like $5 cheaper and it was free shipping. Um, originally wanted to go for the pair that I'm about to show you guys, but that sold out instantly, which I was super surprised. And this sold out, I think probably in a couple hours, in my size at least. So pick these up. Um, and yeah, I've been loving them ever since. I've basically just been looking at District Vision's website every single day to see if they still have my size. Um, as time went on, like a month, month and a half later, they still had my size, but all the other ones were selling out. So like the eight and a halfs were going, the nine and a halfs, the 10, 10 and a halfs, but the nine was still there. So I figured, you know, if I've been thinking and wanting them for over a month, this is my time to grab them. So I picked up the other pair of these and just got them in. So I wanted to show you guys um, how they are. So. Um, I'll show you guys the box. It's no different, but it is pretty cool. So this is going to be the emerald green, just a super vibrant, cool green box. True size nine, fits amazing. And the top has the District Vision New Balance with their little logo right there. And that's really it. Super sturdy, nice emerald green box. But we want to take a look at the shoe. So grab it for you guys this is it right here so super cool looking shoe right here so just to do them side by side really really cool um design that they did for this drop really glad that i have both of them um the reason why i held out for so long is i just didn't think that i needed two of the exact same shoe exact same collab but like I said, as time went by, I just, I didn't stop thinking about them. Uh, it, it was now or never. So I don't have any other brown shoes. So this uh, fits that very well. So the brown isn't like a normal brown. It's like a very light, dark brown, if that makes any sense. Um, check out their Instagram because they did a great marketing photo shoot campaign for this release. I think the white pair is probably documented a little bit more. Um, but this one is definitely cool for sure. So start things out. Uh, you get the hi hiking, running style, trail running, thick Vibram sole right there. So just huge, thick tread. Um, really cool. And then you get this huge sole. So um, in my previous video, I talked about how it seemed like it was unstable. Well, after wearing these for you know over a month maybe two months now they're extremely stable which is insane because the height on these is like bigger than a hoka which is just nuts um so very stable not too cushiony um obviously it's not very firm but just like from the looks of it you would think it would be a super super unstable uh cushioned ride but that's not the case at all so that's why i had to grab these be just because these are so incredibly comfortable. Um, so you get that um, brownish color and it's gonna be different than the top, which is cool. So to start off at the heel, District Vision um, is gonna be in white over that black panel right there. You get the uh, District Vision New Balance hit right there. And I really like how this shoe kind of splits in the back. I think that's a cool uh, design feature for sure. You get the um, District Vision specific New Balance in that they redesigned. So if you look at the typical fresh foams, um, 
they look just very GR and just very like mass produced as far as like the design of the N. And this one, they did their own little twist on it and I think they just did a great job. The uh, toe box is gonna be the exact same. You get really nice, nothing really crazy. Um, and then you get on the toe right there, that black. So all brown with black and then obviously that white hit right there. The inside is gonna be the exact same, nothing crazy. Um, that New Balance in, and what is cool is they got their District Vision New Balance branding right there on the tongue, and then you get another hit of their design right there at the top. So really cool. The insole, just like how they always do, one has New Balance, and the other one has District Vision all throughout. So yeah, that's it. This is the other shoe. Not different at all. It just has the the um, little pamphlet right there. But yeah, super, super excited to have these. Um, no regrets at all. If you can find them, um, if you did want these, I think they probably still have a couple pairs in just the brown. Definitely not the white ones. Um, but yeah, that does it for this review unboxing. I'm so glad I ended up grabbing them and that they had them in my size. Let me know what you guys think. Um, if anyone wants just like a super solid, um, tall, comfortable shoe that isn't a Hoka, this is the way. Um, GR or not, I think I've seen on the New Balance pages that they have some collabs coming. There's one that looks really nice that I think is like a Japan release only. And they have um, another collab that's going to be like a burgundy and um, I think like a pinkish color maybe. But yeah, so I think New Balance is understanding that people do like this, that the, you know, hiking running style shoes are in and they are doing some really cool colorways and collabs. So like I said, I would highly recommend this, this model from New Balance. Grab it um, and be on the lookout for more releases. So that does it. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more.